Hello YouTube, this is Pokemon Mega Man. I'm here to show you uh, my auto builder script for my, the turtles in Computer Craft. So right now I have Tekkit open, it's got Computer Craft installed. Um, let me just open up and create a new uh, single player world. Let me make this a flat one, so creative uh, test and make it super flat with nothing in there. All right. So what we got here is we got our flat, uh, super flat world. We're gonna go ahead and add in a turtle because that's what we need to make our build stuff. Okay, let's put one down. So ID zero, and we've got our uh, turtle right here uh, in Computer Craft. So what we're going to do now is we're going to go ahead and install the mo the uh, script. Uh, right here I've got my uh, the autobuilder.zip file which will download. It's got the auto build script which is the main script that you'll be using for uh, uh, building stuff. It's also got this binvox.exe file and web32.dl read binvox.exe and vvox.exe. Uh, these will all go in a separate directory. These are all t used to generate a voxels.txt file that the auto build uh, application reads. Uh, for now, let's uh, extract all these to its, uh, a folder and then move the auto build f uh, file to your. Uh, down the, uh, to your turtle f directory on here. So that would, for me, it would be uh, app data roaming ticket or technic launcher ticket uh, saves test. Uh, actually, we uh, we can put it on just one computer, but if you want to, you can put them in all by uh, simply dragging them into your uh, mods. Computer craft, uh, G or uh, my bad, not GUI, Lua, ROM, programs, turtle, and then put it into here. I already have it in there too. So it'll work either way. And so now what we're going to do is we're going to actually start to use Binvox right now to create the file that we're trying to make. So right now I've got uh, my in my binbox folder I've got a couple dot obj files and uh, my programs uh, so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna open up a, col a command prompt we're gonna go to um, uh, and from here we want to go ahead and run binbox so uh, we right here it shows you basically how to use it. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and create my model. I'm gonna be using this uh, toy plane .obj as my model. Uh, here's what it looks like in 3ds Max. Uh, I downloaded this off the internet. Uh, so let's go ahead and try this out. So I want it to be about uh, 10 by 10. I no, that seems a little small. Let's try 16 by 16. So we're going to go ahead and do binvox space slash d uh, and 16 and then toy plane dot obj. So it's now rend uh, reading our file. Read why. Alright, and there we go, it's wrote, it's uh, 
347 uh, block model and right now it's saved to my toyplane underscore one dot in box because I already had one in here let me delete that out and so let's drag and drop this over to my vbox.exe and we can see there it is there's the plane uh, it's a smallish toy plane model that I'm going to be rebuilding in Minecraft uh, so it looks all good uh, we're going to go ahead and now drag that over to the read binvox.exe. What this does is takes your uh, mo binvox model and it converts it into a giant text document with uh, tons and ones of zeros. Ones represent blocks that exist, zeros don't. Uh, and then the uh, program that I use reads off those and then uses it to build your model. So what we're going to do is now copy and paste this voxels.txt uh, into your uh, turtle into your turtle uh, directory. So for me that would be uh, under techit saves test computer zero and then I'm going to just paste it right in there. So there it is, voxels.txt, uh, and now what you want to do is, you're ready to build, all you need to do is fill it up with your desired building material of choice, let me get a couple uh, wooden planks, so, up. I should have enough to complete the whole model without having to refill it. Uh, now when you f do fill it, make sure you uh, fill the last slot with something. Uh, it can be just one block, but make sure you have at least one in that slot. Uh, because if you don't, that's the slot that it uses to check when it's empty, uh, and it'll just automatically come down every time. So let's run the auto build program. Uh, it's going to start building it according to our voxels.txt file, and here it goes. Uh, it's starting to build the tail end of the plane, so I'm going to just uh, sit right here and watch it do a time-lapse build of the model. Alright, so it's just about finished here. Uh, that build took about uh, 16 minutes to complete, uh, and there it is, right there. Uh, so that is the auto builder script uh, for Computer Craft uh, by Pokemon Mega Man. Extreme thanks to uh, Binvox, they have the core program for this. Uh, it would be impossible without that. Uh, and here it is. So, I mean, I could do this with any 3D model, uh, be it like a giant monument or a car or something like that. And I could make it so that my turtle prints it for me in Minecraft. So, there you have it. Uh, that's the tutorial.